Honors, what we have is a claim by the plaintiff that the defendant is obligated to her for failure to pay back rentals, utilities, and also for the cost of a, what is this, DNA paternity test that the two of them engaged in. Apparently, the two of them have taken the test and directed that it be furnished to me for my inspection with whomever. Well, in other words, if he's not the father, then she pays. If he is the father, she uh, gets paid. Father. You'll be paying. That's good. Yeah. That's good. Don't, don't get in here. That ain't out. bad. Don't get in here. So well, yes. I, I just, I'm, I'm just, not going to try it in the court. Mm -hmm. Well, just, just chill just a little yes, bit. Sir. Right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, Your Honor. <laughs> Judge Joe Brown. You know how to act better. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Stop. I ain't trying to, I ain't trying to show out. Stop. Would, you, would you stop? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, I'll try not. To. Can you hold still, or are you under the influence? Um, under the influence. Hey. Under the influence. Not right now. Under the influence. But that woman down, <laughs> she done drove me down and influenced a lot of things that I said I'd never do. He gonna lie. Don't, oh, he how gonna can lie. I? When it's the truth. Lie. God knows. Oh, God. <laughs> I wouldn't bring him into it. Uh, you please. Excuse me. How would you take care of him if officially you're unemployed? Thank What's your you. I wasn't unemployed then. You were unemployed. I wasn't unemployed then. Yes, you were. But I was selling. No. Uh, excuse me, Your Honor. He was. He was. Now, he was doing that. But he was he was receiving his daughter's social security check for her mother's death. And he wasn't giving me none like that. Excuse Everybody, me. You, excuse me. Were you re let, let him go. Let, I'm let, going. Let, I'm going to tell the truth. I'm going to tell the truth. Okay. I'll just just my so, let, let him go. I have a purpose. <laughs> You're showing a classic example. All <laughs> that kinetic okay, I'm sorry, movement I'm sorry, from having too much energy. They're just, you know, I'm sorry, you, but you know, it's just hard on me when someone says something. showing the residual effects from. So you've already said that you were moving merchandise. I was, I was, I'm not lying. I'm not denying. I'm not. I'm, I'm here to tell the truth. Not, didn't I say? Uh, didn't I raise my right hand? <laughs> I don't care who hit the truth. The only one can condemn me is God. But Your Honor, you uh, might. You may get a, a a little remark. He worketh in mysterious ways. Don't he? Don't he? Yes. Amen. He does. He works through uh, you right now. <laughs> Whatever you decide. You've candidly admitted that you've been moving merchandise. Oh, hey. Arkansas know it. Who don't know it? When was the last time you've been selling it? I ain't sold no dope in a long time, y'all. I've been smoking dope, and the reason why. You want to know the reason why? For 38 years, I said I never smoked no dope. For 38 years. But I, tell, I found out one thing. Never say what you want. The symptoms he is exhibiting, in my experience, he is actively under the influence. Mm -hmm. oh. He's a crackhead. Thank mm -hmm. you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. I even admitted that. No, he don't. No, he didn't. Do it. Uh, not at first. No, he didn't. Uh, he was <laughs> under the impression now. this is a nice, interesting little thing on a TV show. He's under oath. She is, in fact, a retired deputy mm -hmm. sheriff. I ain't and, no secret. I got uh, busted for selling dope. Excuse me. The testimony here that you give is an under oath subject to penalties of perjury. There you go. Excuse me. And what I have here is a confession by somebody that looks like they're still on extended parole as a habitual offender mm -hmm. uh, after that? having a long... <laughs> I've been, I've, been out of, I've been out of the joint a long time ago. Not long. <laughs> the last three years you got was imposed January 15, 1998, and that'd make you release 2001. That was a Class C felony. I'm uh, that was a third offense of a hell of a possession guy. of a controlled uh, substance no with intent to sell or deliver Schedule Two. They caught me on that. You two. have multiple convictions for felony burglary, and you <laughs> even if I didn't burglarize, I bought it. You have <laughs> aggravated or armed robbery in your history. Baby, now you are I in the status of the declaration. Of the Arkansas courts, a habitual offender. That I am. I don't Three deny. Three strikes, you're out. Next time around, you get life. Oh, uh, I've been doing. I've been selling dope for a long time. Where'd you get it from? <laughs> Wait, who's your supplier? Who's my supplier? Yeah. What you talking about? <laughs> God supplied everything. My need is not everything His. So, uh, if you put it on this earth, no matter who I got it from, God created it, didn't He? 
<laughs> he might not have mixed it and made it that way, but I know if you take earth to earth, where does he go? Hey, you put yourself in this guy. Man, she when loved him, me just as it. much as I love her. He oh, yes, she was. It. You just hadn't <laughs> seen it. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, have you but seen I... his record? No. He got it Man, going back I, a long time. I got a time. big book. Everybody know that. Your Honor, I'm not here to disrespect you in any kind of way. I know like you're I'm not. Saying, you're under the influence, well, and you've been hey, watching I, the clouds One thing, go one thing by. about that, Your Honor. Hold on. And you're giving a good example uh, of Honor. what this looks Your like Honor. when somebody is not around watching, and well, they yeah, hear I, they all these stories. They watch me all the time. What this you talking is what about? it looks like. I don't care who watched me. I know I'm a mess. I, <laughs> <laughs> I, it ain't no secret. <laughs> but when I straighten up, Your Honor... Everything's got a beginning. Don't it have the end? Yeah, that's a test right there. Oh, Lord. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> yeah. Do you really want him to be the one? Oh. No, I don't want him to be. What? What'd you say? Not really. Don't say that. Why? You, uh, then why did you didn't want me to do B? Why did you have another one with me? How you know this one yours? Oh. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, Your Honor. I can bust out laughing at you. <laughs> Please do. I want you to laugh. I want you to be mine. Because either way it go, I'm still going to love him the same. No, you ain't. You don't pay uh, for Don't I God love me the same? You don't pay for me? I wear that Yeah, because everybody else convict me and condemn me. Uh, judge not. And you should not be judged. But the same judgment that you judge with is the same judgment you're going to be judged with. Now go ahead and read it. I'm strong now. I am a Stop fool. A fool. He needs an audience. It's good hey. to here. Everybody in Hard Scramble, everybody in Little Rock, Arkansas know Tommy. No, they know everybody in Little Rock know you. And I don't even want to be known. What drug dealer wants to everybody to know him? <laughs> huh? I don't want to be, but I am. This woman right here, she's something else, but I love her because I'm something else too. <laughs> Y'all just don't Thank know. You. Why you think I fell in love with her? She's just like me. No, I ain't just like you. I ain't no crackhead, y'all. No, she don't I do don't drugs. Just... She don't do no drugs, but she ain't. I ain't just like you. <laughs> Get her mad and see. Read it, read it. Okay. I want to see this. And he's watch 40 TV years again. old, and look how he's acting. I took care of mine in the penitentiary. That, that, that's all, yeah. $400 a week child support for 16 years, and I gave her $400 a week and a thousand and an ounce a dollar. He's 40 years old. He's in habitual criminal status. Next time they get him, which looks to be soon, he'll you be in so? for life. Hmm. Money rule the world. Stay quiet. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. I'll try. <laughs> Come on, read about my child. Twenty-five hundred dollars is going to be your award. I'll let you see it. I'm you glad she's getting the money. Hell, she's all old of my life. Because, hell, that's the reason I'm here this long. I did try to commit suicide. That's what you're doing. You see, that's the well, punchline. You know, well, excuse me. Be quiet. Be quiet. So you yes, know what? Sir. So yes, you sir. know yes, what the problem yes, is? I talk. Excuse me. You uh, know what the problem you're you having right now is? Mm -hmm. Most people who don't really know about these things think it's think I'm on drugs right now. Be quiet. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Go ahead. Told you I'm a mess. We know now. Thing that you don't even want to deal with. You just talk. I know you talk. Be quiet. You don't know much of anything. Now, be so quiet. I may know a little too damn much. That may That's be. The problem. If you open your mouth one more time, I'm going to have you charged with disrupting an arbitration oh, okay. proceeding, and you won't make the airplane. Now, you want to go there? Now, people think drugs cause this problem. They're not the cause most of the time. They are a symptom, and what's going on is... You're trying to commit suicide, and when you die, people will look at you and say, drugs have claimed another victim, but that's a lie because you know it's killing you. You just want to die, and your sorry, pathetic life being in the status of a habitual criminal where you've got six children, you haven't done a damn thing for any of them, you're not prepared to do anything for this one, and you've wasted all of your adult life and done nothing, and you got nothing to show for it. You're ready to die. He's playing. He's playing. Uh, no, he's not really. But anyway. She's laughing. I'll take care of her. I'll take care of her. I'll, care of her. I'll laugh. Sit down before you get jacked up. I think I'll give a damn that to get jacked up. I'm already jacked up. We that's know. suicide. That's what his problem is. You're watching somebody who's trying to achieve his death. Now, that's what you're looking at, and unfortunately, he is the father of your child. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. No, that's not thank you they for anything. They're thanking me. They give me a reason to live. 
you already have six full, and you no, bailed out of those. So what in the devil are you going to do like with you this said, one? I was never there for him. Money ain't everything. Money ain't nothing. You're not here now. You are already dead, remember? Can the hunter dead live again? <laughs> you lost your mind. Yes, he has. Yes. Now, that's the point. You get 3000 as your recovery, which it costs. I don't know what that's going to do for you, but you have provided she an interesting... More. Well, you I know she does. Now, why don't you be quiet before I make it less by getting you the devil out of here and in a jail cell, where I think I might have you sent very shortly. Well, the Lord's will. Yeah, Lord's will.